Hello Gemini, welcome to your situationship reading for this week. If you'd like a personal reading from me, check out the description box below. It's got my email address, which is where you can contact me on. Let me know what kind of reading you'd like, or you can check out my blog. The link is below and it's got all my reading information including prices all right so let's get into your reading how does your person feel about you now gemini how does your person feel about you now how does gemini's person feel about gemini now how does gemini's person about Gemini now. You can double tap to the right of your screen if you'd like to miss the shuffle. How does Gemini, this person, think of Gemini now? How does Gemini's person feel about Gemini now? All right, rest and rejuvenation indicating you might be on a break. You may not have communicated for a little while, Gemini. So there's a break, there's some kind of pause, there's some kind of healing. Okay, needing to rejuvenate, replenish our energy. Um, I didn't ask anything, so I'll, I'll just tell you what these cards mean. We've got um, a lot of uh, creative um wanting okay so in a creative way wanting to connect emotionally all right but that's creative because someone the divine feminine whether that's you or your person has a lot of love to give okay a lot of love to give they're still healing from something gemini and spirit is asking you to be patient all right they do feel a strong spiritual connection to you but right now they're looking for other possibilities um probably not with love i don't know probably most likely just in their life because they're healing from something right now all right it's probably looking for ways to you know come back to you so let's continue with the reading what changes does your person want to make in regards to this Situationship, Gemini. What changes does your person want to make? Door to healing and happiness. So they want to heal the situationship, Gemini. They want to heal the situation. All right. They might want to come back and say, "Well, let's do something about this." So do they have other situationships at the same time? Okay, same card. Uh, with the same card, all right? So this is um, Archangel Ariel saying, again, we want to be creative in our emotional connection. A lot of Netflix and chill and snuggling. Okay, lots of loving. With the woman holding a heart. So there is a lot of love to give, all right? And they want to be emotionally connected with you beautiful so where is this situation ship heading between gemini and the person they're thinking about where is this situation ship heading between gemini and the person they're thinking about where is this situation ship heading between gemini and the person they're thinking about where is this situation ship heading spirit where is this situation ship heading? You can double tap to the right of your screen. I don't know how long I'll be shuffling. Where is this situation ship heading, Spirit? Where is this situation ship heading between Gemini and their situation ship? Spirit, why are you not talking? Where is this situation ship heading? tied up healing and deceit they feel all tied up because they're healing from a deceitful situation to gemini um your person is all tied up because they're still healing from something or could this be you healing from a deceitful situation 
where is this heading you know it, it's about being all tied up uh, because you're healing from something from the past now because this is concerned me i'll ask all right then um so we got the hermit the hierophant and holding on so someone is spending a lot of time alone very committed and holding on not letting go okay um could be self to see and then we've got the moons, yeah, hidden things, okay, from the past. They've got, or you've got things from the past that you, you've hidden and, and it's changing now, leading to loneliness. <coughs> Excuse me. And this is you, Gemini, making a, a decision to possibly cut out some kind of juggle. This is uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is Scorpio, um, this is Pisces, I can't remember judgment. Um, yeah, I can't remember. And then you've got Virgo, you've got Taurus here. Okay, and you've got Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So cutting out a juggle and going with an earth sign. Could be sun, moon or rising. Okay, so the juggle could be indicating a deceitful situation, Gemini. Alright, but yeah, you, you want to cut that out. Maybe the juggling between two or a, another situation, some kind of, could be working two jobs, could be children, could be, you know, another partner, could be caring for somebody. There's something in the background that is tying them up or you up and healing you know from that and maybe deceiving yourself or there is some kind of deceit or lies whether that's self-imposed or towards one another uh, spending a lot of time alone uh, committed and and holding on i'm not going to let you go but there is hidden things from the past that are changing leading to loneliness someone is making a decision probably you gemini to cut out the juggle and go with the earth sign okay so what should you do for the best outcome of this situation what should gemini do for the best outcome and we have journey all right what you should do for the best outcome so journey journey of the soul journey as in geographical journey why is journey here spirit thank you okay going from feeling all tied up okay moving on from feeling all tied up to actual abundance and family happiness and prosperity gemini um, so there's a there's a change coming up for you. What should you do? Okay, there could be travel, uh, uh, leaving a situation where you feel bound towards a prosperity, abundance, and happiness, and family togetherness for a long time. That's like forever. Gemini, quite a prominent. Um, <laughs> uh message isn't it so will this make you happy goddess of the moon uh i think this is a very this is a very strong um strong spiritual connection that you feel with this person could be in a month's time this is generally at the end of the week but sometimes there's a month cycle spirit why is goddess of the moon here i feel this is a very spiritual connection why is Goddess of the Moon here for Gemini Spirit? Very um, connected. I just feel like this is almost like Two of Cups. The hangman. So there is stillness and pause and just staying um, suspended in time. Uh, will this situation should make you happy? You need to look you know, in alter for an alternative route kind of thing it's about being a little bit outside the box this is also self-sacrifice if you want this person gemini 
a lot of self-sacrifice and going within um, to actually look for the best outcome for you. Gemini, I feel this is really up to you, this situation ship. Because there is a journey and it is really between feeling all tied up or moving on, cutting out the juggle and, and not being lonely and going towards the person that you want to build and grow with. You've got pentacles here, ten of pentacles, which is forever happiness in abundance, prosperity and family. And I feel this is a journey just to make this decision and once you have, it's going to be going within and really trying to figure out what is right for you. Alright, let me know how this resonates. I send you love, peace and light always. Bye for now.